In an earlier video, we showed how to make a blueprint using the Duplicator plugin. In this video, we're going to show you how to make a blueprint without having to use that extra plugin. This only works in the premium version. We'll choose Export here, and you can choose to Export or Deploy. We're going to do an Export, and since we're making a blueprint, the Export As doesn't really matter. But just for fun, I'll put in Dev. Now you can see here we have an option to direct deploy to an existing server. We're going to look at that in another video. Right now, I'm just going to export to a website archive zip file. Now this information is really only needed if you're using this for backup purposes. We're not. We're making a blueprint again, so we can leave it all blank. And now we need to choose where we want to put this file. Right now it's going into documents websites, but we don't want that. We want it to go into XAMPP Blueprints. And we can choose to encourage search engine visibility, which we don't really care about. And we can purge post and page revisions. That's probably a good thing. It makes our zip smaller. And again, we don't want to customize the scrubbing options. So we hit Next, and it's done. Now, you may recall, we need to restart desktop server in order to be able to see new blueprints. So now we'll go to Create New, and there is the zip file for the new blueprint that we made. I'm not going to bother creating a new site using it because we didn't really change anything, and it would be exactly like the other site we made. But that's all there is to creating a blueprint with desktop server.